Hi guys, Alex Shuke here at All Seasons RV in Streetsboro, Ohio. Today I will be explaining the 2021 Alpha Wolf 22 SW. This is going to be a great couples coach um, just for you and another person when you just want to get up and go and travel and somewhere simple. Um, so right around front, you are going to have a nice pass-through storage. So you do have access on this storage on the door side and the opposing side. Um, and then you'll see right up front, you will have your battery disconnect. So even when you're not using it during the summer, you don't always have to unhook all the wires um, from your battery. You can just uh, take your battery disconnect and click it off. Um, and then right here, you're going to get a nice outside kitchen. This one, this one will come with a two burner stove, a mini fridge, an ice maker, and a high pressure spray port. So that's going to be a little bit different than an outside shower. It's actually going to have quite some pressure to hose down muddy boots. Um, animals, anything like that. Um, you are going to get two marine grade speakers on the outside with a nice TV backer, your cable sound hookups, and then your regular outlets. So even if you wanted to bring a table out here, hook up a, um, a crock pot, anything like that, you can't do so. This one is going to come equipped with a nice big power awning that is almost the full length of your camper with a nice blue LED strip underneath it um, to uh, illuminate your campground that night. Um, and then right around back, you are going to get a travel rack that is capable up to 200 pounds. So that's going to be great for firewood, um, coolers, storage bins, uh, generators, anything that you can possibly think of up to 200 pounds. Now this one is going to be prepped for a backup camera. Um, so that's going to be the Purion observation camera. You can either get it in a 5 inch or a 7 inch. And uh, what's nice about the observation versus the backup is you can have that on at all points in time, not just when you're backing up your camper. And then um, these are going to have the nice new black safety glass doors. It's just a little bit of a classier look, and you can't put a shade on that window from the inside. And then obviously the new uh, more right steps. These are the stable sturdy steps that you can adjust by height. By all you have to do is push in the pin in the back. Then you can adjust the height of the stairs up and down. So even if you are at a little bit of a cockeyed slope, you will be nice and uh, level at all times. So we'll hop on the inside. So inside you are just going to get two massage and heater theater seating recliners. And then you are going to get TV trays for each one. So you do have a place to eat. And then right in front is where you're going to put your TV if you would like to. Um, and then you do have your outlets, your USB ports, and then your radios underneath it. Your radio is going to be AM, FM, Bluetooth, HDMI, and USB compatible radio. And then underneath that is going to be your fireplace. Your fireplace is going to be strictly electric, uh, and it does have an ambience mode. So if you just want it to look pretty without blowing any heat, you can do so. And then your kitchen is going to be next to it. So that is going to have a three burner stove um, with your cast iron grill right here. Um, and then you're going to have an oven. It'll fit, you know, your cookie sheet, your pizza, stuff like that. Your microwave is going to be above that. And then you are going to have your black stainless steel farmhouse style kitchen sink. This is going to be great because it is farmhouse, so you can get all your pots and pans. And with it being stainless steel versus plastic, you can actually put hot water in there without it buckling and uh, breaking. Um, and this was built after the COVID era, so you do have hand sanitizing stations now. Um, that's a little fun thing that they're doing. And then you can put uh, regular soap and dish soap, whatever you feel like putting in there. You do have plenty of cabinets above. You have drawers uh, below. And then you do have more cabinets right behind us, as you see. And they are pretty deep. Right next to your old, new 11 cubic foot. And then right next is going to be your new 11 cubic foot Canon fridge. This is a 12 volt. Uh, to a 110 inverter so it is safe to have it on while you're traveling and it will run off your battery um, and it's always a little bit better than gas because you don't get those gas crates in here so you actually get the full use of your fridge um, it will cool down a lot quicker gas fridges usually take anywhere between 24 to 48 hours to cool down these take about 20 minutes now and you don't get those ugly vent holes on the outside of your camper more spots for mice bugs to get into so, and then in the back, you are going to get uh, your new farmhouse style door, just a classier look, and a bigger bathroom. So I'll let the camera go in there. Below, you get a nice porcelain toilet, and then a nice uh, shower, and then a fantastic fan above. 
because those stinky times you don't want to stink up your entire camper and then you actually do get a linen closet and those are pretty deep and a medicine cabinet above your sink all right so then we'll walk to your bedroom so your bedroom is also going to have the farmhouse style door and you're actually going to have plenty of room to walk around on each side of the bed not a lot of bedrooms in your travel trailers do give you that comfort of a full-size bedroom so you're actually going to have closets on either side um, and then you are going to have cabinets that do flip up instead of the side versions and you can put mounts on here so these can hold themselves up um, and then what's nice is they actually put like uh, little trays on the side so you actually get nightstands so if you have CPAP machines laptops tablets phones books you can put them on here with your outlets and then your USB ports and then right behind here you do have a TV backer so if you want to put a TV here you would just plug it in right here with all your cable and uh, sound connect, uh, connections and then your outlet connection and then you do get two coat hangers robe hangers uh, whatever you want to put underneath there and then you do have storage underneath your bed as well so you do have plenty of spots for cushions, uh, bed linens, um, uh, pillows, anything that you can think of. So that's just going to be a quick run through of your 2021 um, Alpha Wolf. And then one last thing before I do uh, let it go. This is going to have one of the biggest pantries in a travel trailer. So I look at it as a coat closet, a broom closet, and a giant pantry. So you can do whatever you want in here. All right, now I think that's gonna be it for your 2021 Alpha Wolf 22 SW. Um, if you guys have any questions, feel free to uh, contact us at our website at asrvs.com. And don't forget to like us on Facebook. My name again is Alex, and thanks for watching.